The Shepherd Chemical Company is the industry leader in BCN technology for airbags. We are proactive in anticipating any potential improvements our customers may be able to benefit from. All particles change over time, and sometimes stability changes lead to changes in performance, particularly because BCN controls the oxidation and burn rate of airbag inflation we want to ensure that our product produces the most stable generant possible. We tested BCN under extreme conditions and found that it does change the particle properties. Today I want to tell you what we discovered, the potential solution we created, and why we need your help to conduct a stability study of the generant used in airbags incorporating Shepard's new stabilized BCN. With your partnership, we can determine if we have found a way to make BCN even better for automobile airbag generant. If so, Shepard Chemical and our customers will be able to offer the automobile industry a new product. Allow me to go into a little more detail. To make the world's leading generant formula, basic copper nitrate, BCN, is mixed with guanidine nitrate. During a car crash, this mixture is ignited and nitrogen and carbon dioxide gases are produced very rapidly, inflating the airbag. The reaction between BCN and guanidine nitrate can be impacted by the physical properties of the two reactive components, such as particle size, surface area, porosity, density, and moisture content. Changes in these particle parameters could cause changes in performance. The challenge is to understand how the materials age over time through exposure to environmental conditions after the manufacturing process and the impact these changes could have on airbag deployment. More specifically, our study sought to understand how humidity and temperature impacted the physical properties of BCN, such as surface area, particle size, density, pH, and the moisture content. A recently manufactured lot of BCN was sampled and aged under temperature and relative humidity conditions ranging from 8 to 85 degrees C and 5 to 95 percent relative humidity for one week. The samples were analyzed for changes in surface area, particle size and density. We also collected electron micrographs and x-ray diffraction patterns. We discovered that at 50 degrees C and 50% relative humidity, the particles are larger and smoother than they are at ambient conditions. At 85 degrees C and 95% relative humidity, the particles are starting to grow together, form larger clumps, in behavior that's consistent with oxalate ripening. This was corroborated with a reduction in the measured specific surface area. Interestingly, preliminary kinetic studies show that the most significant decrease in surface area occurs within the first 24 hours. This observation suggests that the decrease in surface area might be similar to an exponential decay process where the rate of decay is dependent on the humidity and the temperature. All the while, composition and diffraction analyses showed that there were no chemical changes to the product. It remained BCN the whole time. But as the particle size increased, the surface of the particles changed from rough or porous to smooth. Could this be problematic for generate made from BCN? This remains an open question. One technique for suppressing BCN aging is to limit its exposure to moisture. Effective packaging is a very practical method for improving the surface area stability of these types of materials. Shepard offers several packaging options and takes additional steps to ensure that BCN reaches our customers as close as possible to as-made condition. But these approaches do not address the root of the issue, which is that BCN can change with time. We are now evaluating new proprietary techniques to reduce BCN susceptibility to moisture accelerated aging. Our results show that modification to the preparation process can have a drastic impact on how BCN ages in the presence of elevated temperatures and moisture. Samples of BCN prepared with our new patent-pending method showed no significant changes in surface area after exposure to 95% relative humidity and 50 degrees C for five days. However, our standard BCN exhibited about a 30% drop in surface area over the same period of time. Now imagine with me, what if we could make airbags safer? What if our new stabilized BCN could increase the service life of airbag inflators? What would this mean to the automobile industry? We need your help. 
Use our new proprietary stabilized BCN and conduct a stability study using your generant. Help us confirm the value this will create in the automobile market. Please contact me, Rob Hart, at 513-731-1110, bcn at shepchem.com for more details and copies of our study.